You deserve some time off, and with Odoo, taking some well-deserved downtime is easy. Here at ThrillQuest Ventures, we spend our days planning adventures for our customers. But when it comes to planning our own getaways, sick time, and work from home, we count on Odoo's time off application. Let's check it out. This is the time off dashboard where our team can see all their requests for the calendar year. On the calendar, I can see the approved days I've already taken off and the status of my future time off requests. I can also view the holidays that we've blocked off for the whole company. Up here, I can see all the time off allotments broken down by type. I can see exactly how many hours and days I still have available and when they expire. I can even see how much time I will acquire like this. I have a big trip coming up later this year and I want to ensure enough time is saved up. This makes it so easy to plan ahead. Let's take a look at the different time off types, including sick time, vacation time, and even volunteering time. Recently, we decided to add a great new benefit, paid time off for training opportunities. I'll start by setting it up here in the configuration menu. We need to know what training our employees are taking and this type of time off will require approval. Instead of leaving it to the time off officer, we'll let each employee's manager decide if the training is appropriate. This will be important later since I'm a manager too. I can configure the time off types by variables such as approval type, kind of time off, and the time allowance. There are also all sorts of restrictions we can add on like whether our employees can take this time as just a few hours or an entire day. Let's allocate five days for this time off type with no set expiration date. Now I can set the allocation at a company level or by an employee. Since this benefit is for the entire ThrillQuest Ventures team, I'll choose the company option. Now that this new time off type is set, one of our employees, Joy, is ready to put in her request. When Joy logs in, she can see all her available time off here. From her employee profile, she clicks on you, selects the time off type and the assigned day, and submits her request. It's that easy. Since I'm Joyce Manager, I get a notification as soon as my approval is needed for a time off request, allowing me to respond right away. A quick check on the management time off dashboard and I'll validate it. Have a great time, Joy. But don't worry, if I forget to approve a request, Odoo won't let it slip through the cracks. If I check the payroll application, I can see if there are any holdups for our accounting team relating to time off. It looks like a few issues are popping up in the warnings dashboard. Ah, that's the problem. These space lips can be generated until I approve time off requests for this employee. Let's take care of that right now. And there we go. Sometimes we need the entire team in the office for important events, like company team building. Since our company retreat is coming up, we need to block off those days to ensure everyone attends. I'm going to set these up as mandatory days so that no one will be able to request these days off. I'm sorry, Joy, but we will need you at the team building activities that week. But don't worry, we'll make it fun. Taking time off shouldn't be stressful, and that's why we use Odoo. The time up application takes the guesswork out of the scheduling and approving requests and integrates it so nicely with the rest of Odoo's suite of HR apps. Odoo, because amazing employees deserve amazing software.